Christmas miracles can come in many shapes and sizes, but this Christmas that I'm going to tell you about is a surprise to all. I'm Lily, and I'll be talking about the backstory of the famous Christmas song, Silent Night. This podcast was created by students at Rising Star Middle School as part of the Guidance Department's Make Kindness Normal initiative. It is produced in collaboration between the Community for Creativity, Hall Pass Entertainment, and Panther Radio. Worsening weather conditions made it almost impossible for anyone to be in a good mood. The First World War was getting colder and colder as the nights creeped onward towards what would normally be a Christmas holiday at home by the fire. Soldiers found themselves ducking and covering from incoming gunshots. The sounds of guns, bombs, and soldiers yelling for relief echoed through the countryside. As the night grew closer to midnight on Christmas Eve, a strange sound occurred over the battle cries. Soon, British troops across the lines began to join in or sing their own carols. Brave soldiers began to make their way into the area between the two lines called No Man's Land. They decided to be brave and risk their own lives to go and say Merry Christmas to their opponents, which would have been a horrible idea, but with kindness it made history. They met up with enemy soldiers to exchange gifts and souvenirs. Tomorrow, guns would ring again. Men would fall. But in their hearts, they would have a moment of kindness and peace to keep them warm. And that was the Christmas truce. You've probably heard the song Silent Night, which is called Stille Nacht in German. Well, it is based off the story of Christmas in the Trenches. Priest and poet Josef Mohr wrote the lyrics for the song you now associate with Christmas. The words were adapted by Franz Xaver Gruber and turned into a holiday carol in 1816. You can see how kindness can work even in very rough conditions. With kindness there may not even be wars, which shows us that we should make kindness an everyday thing. It only took one soldier to be kind for the whole battlefield to join. So next time you're in a situation where you can be kind, be the one soldier. for listening to our podcast. If you want to learn more about the Christmas truce, find history.com, which is where we got all of our fascinating information. This podcast was created by the following 7th grade production team. Producer, Matthew Wysong. Host, Lily Hinson. Editor, Nolan Gutierrez. Sound designer, Miles Toring. And scriptwriter, Jilly Cleland. Vocal music was performed by members of the Stars Mill High School Choral Department.